That's an amazing list. I mean, when you think about those individuals, the contributions that they've made to the game, uh, individuals that they've inspired uh, throughout their career and, and well past, uh, Chris Ebert, Brian Gottfried, uh, just the, the opportunity to have my name associated uh, or even on the same sheet is, is not just an honor, it's, it's quite frankly flattering. Well, there's no doubt that he uh, fits the criteria. I mean, he was number one in all the age divisions all the way up. He won the Grand Slam of the, uh, of the, junior, of the junior national tournaments, and uh, in addition to our state championships. So. And of course, he was trained early on by Rick Macy up there, which was a, a great break for him. And his family was interested and, and uh, got involved. And, and Tommy showed right away that he was a good player. And, so in my mind, he's probably pound for pound throughout the, the, uh, his junior career was as, as good a boy as we've ever had. Reaching number one in, in the boys' 12s uh, Florida rankings was clearly probably the first uh, highlight. Uh, just, just working that hard and, and starting outside the top 100 and winning some of the, some of the prestigious uh, tournaments that were held in Florida, uh, the sport goofy. The Orange Bowl, uh, all, all, all occurring in Florida were just uh, amazing experiences and, and, and quite frankly when I look back, some of the, clearly some of the highlights. I definitely would not have had the career uh, I had if it wasn't for growing up in Florida. And uh, you know, the infrastructure that was created for me in, in Florida tennis was uh, seamless. It, it, uh, my experiences at, at the tennis tournaments uh, were exciting. Uh, they motivated me. Um, so, you know, and, and the, the ability to do that, uh, I think, comes from, you know, the, the leadership at the very top, the volunteers, uh, the referees, the tournament uh, directors, all of those individuals that uh, create an exceptional and exciting experience uh, for the kids is what drives kids to want to continue to strive for those dreams. So I think, I think for me, Clearly, Florida provided all of those things and more, uh, and so uh, you know, I, I, I definitely would say that uh, for my experience, for, for my personality, and for where I was developing the, and the rapid pace that I was developing, um, it, it gave me everything I needed uh, to accomplish what I did. And again, it, it goes back to the organization itself that creates the infrastructure and uh, the ability to, to keep all of those great players playing against each other week in and week out. And although you knew it was going to be tough, uh, there's just, just knowing that it's going to be great tennis and going out there and, and you know it's going to be a dogfight. And, uh, and that's, that's I think, is, which was enjoyable about Florida tennis, is that you knew that some of the best players, if not at that time, the best players in the country, uh, were all in the same section and you were going to see these individuals week in and week out. Uh, it's something that has brought all of us together. Um, and when I look back, I, I, I'd say that everyone uh, that touches the game, that clearly back then I would not have been able to, uh, to identify or even comprehend what, what their contributions and their um, giving to the game meant uh, is, is going to be a large part of why, one, I, I stayed motivated, uh, two, I developed, uh, and three, uh, that I stay, continually stayed passionate uh, about the game well after uh, my time in the juniors. So now set point for Tommy Ho, trying to get even at a set apiece out here against Brad Gilbert. Tommy Ho, a qualifier, has wins over Sanchez and Jim Grab. He has some experience. Yeah. Ho opens up. And an ace for Tommy Ho. And we are dead even out here on court 16. Stay with us. We're at the U.S. Open. We'll be back with more right after this. And so, you know, when I look at that uh, and, and clearly would not have had the opportunity to say um, thank you to so many individuals that have been uh, huge contributors uh, and clearly deserve credit of anything that I did in Florida tennis. Uh, there's no better time than now to say Thank you to the USTA Florida family. Uh, this is clearly an honor. Uh, I am flattered uh, to be associated with names uh, that have academies, um, that have uh, buildings named after them.
that continue to, to motivate uh, many people in the game, not just in this country but around the world. To be associated with, with those type of individuals uh, is clearly an honor.